Hey, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm gonna talk about top 5 best portable photo printers. Starting at number 5. Canon PIXMA MG3620. If you only print photos once in a blue moon and want to spend as little as possible, check out the Canon PIXMA MG3620. Except for its lower capacity 100 sheet input tray and lack of Wi-Fi direct support, ability to generate its own wireless signal, it's very similar to the Canon PIXMA TS7720 above feature-wise. As for the print quality, while printed photos look detailed, they tend to be darker due to the printer's narrower color range. There's also a noticeably warm tint, which some may not like. It still performs better than many office-oriented inkjet printers, even models costing significantly more. It uses a two-cartridge system like the Canon above, but thankfully, the cartridges are cheap. Coming at number 4. Canon PIXMA TS7720. Our best budget pick is the Canon PIXMA TS7720, a cheaper, ADF-less variant of the Canon PIXMA TR7820 we've tested. Although it has a lower print resolution than the other printers mentioned, it performs surprisingly well, producing incredibly detailed photos. It supports borderless printing and various paper sizes up to 8.5 inches by 11 inches. The drawback with budget models is usually page yield, and that's absolutely the case here. It's not too bad if you only print once in a while, just know that you'll have to pay more for replacement ink than the models mentioned above if you print often. Also, it uses only a tricolor cartridge, so you'll have to replace it even if only one color runs out. This model is on sale at the time of writing. Its MSRP is 150 US dollars, though the price has dropped steadily since its release. If you miss the sale, it might be worth waiting a bit. The median price looks to be around 99 US dollars. At number 3. Epson EcoTank ET. For a more modest mid-range pick, we chose the Epson EcoTank ET2400. Like our Epson pick above, this is also an all-in-one super tank model, so it's a great option for those with a large print load. However, unlike the Epson EcoTank Photo ET8500, which uses six different inks, with the addition of gray and photo black, it has a more traditional setup with the usual cyan, magenta, yellow, and black ink. Its color range isn't as good but still excellent, it just struggles with bright, saturated tones, meaning some bright highlights won't come out as well compared to more expensive photo printers like the ones above. Printed pictures still look detailed and reasonably color accurate, albeit slightly grainy. You can connect to the printer via USB or Wi-Fi, just know that it doesn't support Apple AirPrint and Mopria print service, so you may need to download the Epson Smart Panel Companion app to get full functionality on mobile devices. The app lets you print, scan, and perform maintenance tasks. It also gives you easy access to Epson's image gallery, which contains patterns you can use for crafts, like house decorations and greeting cards. Unfortunately, its printing speed is pretty slow, taking almost a minute and a half to produce a 4-inch by 6-inch photo. Another option in the same price range is the Canon PIXMA TR8620A. It's more color accurate than the Epson, especially skin tones, but its color range is slightly more limited, leading to some loss of fine details. There are a couple of feature differences, too. It has an SD card reader, so you can print directly from the SD card, and unlike the Epson, it supports Apple AirPrint and Mopria print service. The downside is that it doesn't yield nearly as many prints, so you'll have to spend more on ink over time. Number 2 of my list. Epson EcoTank. If you want a cheaper option that still produces beautiful photo prints, get the Epson EcoTank Photo ET8500, a variant of the Epson EcoTank Photo ET8550 we tested. It performs identically to the flagship ET8550 but can only print on paper up to 8.5 inches by 11 inches in size, whereas the ET8550 supports up to 13 inches by 19 inches. It also has a smaller 8.5 inch by 11.7 inch flatbed scanner, 8.5 inches by 14 inches on the ET8550. Wide format printing is more of a niche use, so the ET8500 probably makes more sense for most people. 
If you need wide format printing or a larger flatbed scanner, the ET8550 is an excellent choice, just expect to pay more for the extra features. Like the Canon ImageProGraph Pro 300 above, this printer produces detailed and colorful photos. The main difference is color accuracy. It isn't wildly off, it just oversaturates colors to make them more vibrant. The pictures still look amazing, but expect them to look slightly different than the original. One major advantage it holds over the Canon printer is its lower ownership costs, as it uses a refillable ink tank that yields significantly more prints. You also get a scanner to digitize photos. In addition to the usual Wi-Fi, USB, and Ethernet connectivity, this model can print directly off a USB flash drive or SD card. And number 1. Canon ImageProGraph Pro. If photo printing is the most important thing to you, we recommend the Canon ImageProGraph Pro 300. This professional-grade model produces incredibly detailed, vibrant, and color-accurate pictures. It supports borderless printing and various paper sizes up to 13 inches by 19 inches, making it a great choice for making posters and signs. Connectivity options include Wi-Fi, USB, and Ethernet, and there's support for Apple AirPrint and Mopria print service, so you can easily print from your mobile devices without installing any drivers or a third-party app. This printer uses nine cartridges, including specific photo cartridges that work only on glossy photo paper, meaning you won't have to worry about depleting the photo ink when printing documents or reports. There's also a special chroma optimizer cartridge to seal photos for improved longevity and shine. The downside is that the ink cartridges are only good for about 400 color prints and are expensive, so you'll have to spend a fair amount of money on ink. Another downside is that it's a print-only model, so you'll need a separate scanner to digitize photos. Check out this video description for latest price and more informations. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe and stay tuned.